Manhattan High School has welcomed many foreign exchange students since the 1960s. This year, the MHS community has opened their doors to eight more exchange students. Reporter Macy Burning has more. High school can be a difficult time for many students, but what if a student traveled across the world to spend 11 months of his life in a foreign country? Andrea Zanidi, originally from Rome, Italy, has chosen just that path for his junior year of high school. At this time, I was a little, a little worried, but when I came here, like the town is not that bad. Like, could be very worse. Like, I know other my friends uh, are doing the same thing, and they're like in small town. They're like nothing. It's like nothing. Many students here at Manhattan High School are very welcoming and supportive of the exchange students, and even welcome them into extracurricular activities. Host parents are also involved within the exchange students' culture by taking a course to learn about their home countries before the students arrive in Kansas. Even faculty have hosted foreign exchange students in the past, like Principal Hoyt and Counselor Tony Wishman. My, my son, my actual son, I have a junior here and so forth, said the world comes to us. Uh, we don't necessarily have to travel the world, so we get the exposure and understanding of, of different cultures with really having not to have to go outside of Kansas and so forth. One of the most valuable things that host families and exchange students can get out of this program is the connections made during their stay and where those connections take them after they leave. The, the one thing that really uh, I don't like about AFS is, uh, or exchange programs is saying goodbye to them. In Manhattan, Macy Burning, Channel 8 News. Zendetti has until the middle of June to soak up the sun in America before he says goodbye to his Kansas family and returns to his home country of Italy.